Hi, and welcome to another series of Repack tutorials. In this session, we will go over the basic concepts in Repack production. First, we need to understand specific implementation types of Repack production. As a small business software, Repack is in general, focused on the next three different types of production. First one, project production or standard production. The second one is installation project which covers different on-site productions. The third one is repair and service, specially designed for workshops and service and repair companies. Now let's examine some specific components of the user interface, specially designed for production. First, component enables the user to add work orders and project document visually. As you can see, you can add inline work orders or sub-ordered work orders. Each work order is represented as a card. Each card contains detail regarding the input materials, output products and work operations used in a work order. Great feature of this view is to see bill of materials rendered by components and materials used to create an outputted product. Another component is the called Gantt chart. Gantt charts represent an easy way to organize and schedule time execution for each work order in the production project. Also, Gantt charts are available in production lists, so you can see a progress overview of the each project. Now we will go through each of the production models. 